Aloha. Look at this beautiful stand of kihili. Now, its scientific name is Hadicium gardnerianum. And here at Savage Kitchen, we use one common name, butterfly ginger, to describe three different plants. Kahili ginger, Hadicium gardnerianum, white butterfly ginger, Hadicium coronarium, and yellow butterfly ginger, Hadicium flavescens. Now, all three butterfly gingers have the butterfly shape to their flowers, and they all can be used interchangeably. We can eat the butterfly ginger flowers, flower buds, rhizomes, and new shoots. Notice the way that the leaves come off of the stem in an alternate leaf pattern. Now, the leaves are shaped like a lance, and the edges are smooth. There's a smooth leaf margin. The top sides of the leaf are smooth, and on the kahili, it's nearly hairless on the bottom. The white has a little more hair on the undersides, and the yellows are like straight up hairy underneath. Overall, Butterfly gingers are about three to eight feet tall, one to two and a half meters. The kahili preferring a little bit of elevation and kind of medium moisture, whereas the white and yellows prefer a little bit moisture and a little bit warmer. Kahili ginger is on the list of top 100 most invasive species on the planet. This stuff is real deal invasive. So when we cut the flower heads, we literally prevent further seed dispersal. Now, if you're harvesting rhizome from any of our three butterfly ginger, make sure that you transport it in a sealed container of some kind. Now, when you get home, any unused portion of the rhizome or the root, you're gonna make sure and put that into the trash. No compost. I have seen this stuff re-sprout after like years underneath a tarp or inside a bucket that's contained. So really important that we're not spreading this around further. So mahalo for your kakua. So we have all of these incredible butterfly gingers to work with. We've taken the rhizome of the kahili and we have some gari for our sushi pickle. We have kahili ginger flowers made into onion jam for these puffs. We have kahili ginger candies and yellow butterfly ginger wild yeast making a natural fizzy drink. And we have the yellow butterfly quiche and we have the mac nut spread that's made with the kahili. So, so many incredible recipes. Be sure and check them out at the Savage Kitchen app as well as our online wild food courses.